change and removing the steps came about. Then we're going to tie ribbons to the steps, take some photos, hopefully you'll come and join us on the steps. We're going to pass the blue bike path down the steps and then we're going to go round to the site where the bridge will be, the bottom of Clark Street, for a non-opening of the bridge. So, okay. I want to tell you about two Liberals who supported the bike budget because I want to contrast them with the Premier. I want to show you that building bike facilities is a mainstream bike Liberal budget, thing. Bike budget, bring it back! Bike budget, bring it back! Bike budget, bring it back! Yeah. Welcome everybody to the uh, north opening of the Clark Street Bridge. Yay. The second thing I want to talk about is the, uh, the, the transport importance of this bridge. We're standing in an area which the state government tells us is the epicentre of the transport problems uh, for Melbourne. In fact, the problems are so bad that they plan to spend $10 million to solve them because there's 100,000 people coming off the end of the Eastern Freeway trying to get through the arterial roads and they're going to spend $10 million. Now, at that rate, we've only got to get 50 people using this bridge and we've paid for this bridge. So a year ago, you remember Cadell won the tour. The Premier certainly noticed that. <coughs> he, bought a, <coughs> he bought a yellow shirt and a yellow tie and made sure to stand very close to Cadell for as long as he could. <laughs> he also followed up on that commitment I talked about back up on the bridge. So in 2010, Labor had said that they would build a bridge and that uh, in the euphoria of the tour, the Premier said, don't worry, we're going to do it. But since then, there's been silence. Uh, no nests have been cleared, no pencils have been sharpened, and there's been no exploratory drilling either. The city of Garra has been ready to go, the state government has been silent. Well, you'd be pleased to know that when we announced this demonstration, not immediately, but a couple of days afterwards, as the uh, information filtered through, we started to get emails and phone calls, not all of which were polite. The gist of what they were saying is, we haven't lost the file, we have cleared the death, and we are sharpening a pencil. However, it will take us one year to design the bridge, and another year to build it. There's no explanation for the gas year which they've taken. And that gas year probably would have gone on if you hadn't shown commitment by being here today and forcing the issue here. I don't know how long this struggle is going to be, but I certainly feel uplifted by your presence here today and your commitment. We're going to go as hard as we can, and I think we can win. Thank you very much. Full bottle of Ritalin couldn't hold his adrenaline He got that fire inside and it's killing him Crowd going wild, his style, he got it down in Anticipation, waiting to make his mark Play his part, coach put him in Cause he got the heart of a champion On the go like a transient About to prove to the world just what kind of man he is His arms sweaty, body heavy Moment he prepared all his life for when he ready It's here now, the time is just coasting Everything stopped